All right, so I'm gonna try to finish this painting today. We're gonna be doing the background. Uh, we're gonna be doing clouds. There's a, there's a few things I'm gonna try to hide in it. I'm gonna try to film this, and this is my several attempts at trying to film painting. But uh, lately it becomes a real um, strange thing. Uh, it's not working when I'm doing it. This I'm gonna try even harder because it's, it's clouds and I should be able to work on it, but my camera uh, will record but it will just automatically stop at a certain point and uh, it makes a clicking sound when it does that but if I have loud music on, I don't hear it. Um, so lots of stuff gets cut off. So you might see things get cut off during this um, but that's basically uh, what's going on when that happens. But yeah, the, the paint on here is more or less dry. I went ahead and made the butterflies black because I'm kind of going to be painting over them a little bit today. Um, I'm going to blend some of the black with it, but basically when the background is fully dry, I'm going to go back in and redo the butterflies. Um, so you'll see me kind of go over them a little bit today. Don't freak out, because when the paint dries, it thins a little bit, and you can see the butterflies behind it. Alright, so hope to see you guys on the other side of this, and uh, we'll see how it turns out.
Well, that was a bit of a ride. Uh, filming that wasn't too bad. I'm definitely going to be doing more of that in the future. There was one point, I think as you see in the video, that uh, it skips because it stopped recording and I kept going and didn't know. And, but for the most part, I think we got everything. I'm still not completely finished with it. I've got to redo the circle, redo the silver in the circle and redo the butterflies. Um, I have no idea what I'm looking at after looking at an image that long. Um, I don't know if it's good or anything like that. So any comments that you have about it would be very much appreciated. I thank you all so much for your support for the show. Um, this would obviously be a pre-sale, so this is already sold. Um, but it's an important piece for me for the show. I'm going through a lot of stuff right now. Um, a lot of it is, is negative, to be honest with you. But it's through a positive light. I'm attempting to deal with some issues that are coming up um, that are pretty obvious to me. And um, it's kind of what I asked for with the show. But I've had some very strange experiences painting for it thus far. I, I feel great about it, um, as this process, but it's bringing up a lot of stuff. It's causing um, me to have to look at a lot of things very, very honestly and try to figure them out. But this is obviously, um, a portrait of my wife. Um, the piece is going to be about prudence. I haven't exactly finalized what the name's going to be yet. It could be Prudentia, or it could, I could just name it Prudence. But Prudence is, is you know, basically the eighth virtue. And without my wife, uh, the, the person that I trust the most in my life, I definitely wouldn't be where I'm at. I definitely wouldn't have the abilities um, that I have now. She supports me and sees me through really, really uh, the worst times of my life. And so if I'm going to do a show about Ascension, it's really important to me that she's part of the show somehow and that she's represented as this because she represents uh, prudence. I go to her and go to her to it for advice and she teaches me and helps me in that way. So it's really important for me to get a piece of her in the show. and. I haven't painted her in a long time, and the reason is is because painting someone you know and someone that you love is really difficult because you see so many faces in their one face, um, and you're trying to get that in there. When you're painting someone you don't know, it's just light and shadows and the intent, but when you're painting someone that you know and that you love, there's a lot of things that go into that. So it's a relatively important piece for me. I have no idea what I'm looking at, so obviously, again, if you guys are willing to let me know what you think. Um, hope you're having a great week, and I will see you all this week.